Hello, HighTechLegion.com. This is Skate and Eric. Um, I'm going to show you a quick little tutorial on how to set up Ifinity. Um, this is in tangent with uh, the Sapphire Radeon HD 6870 Flex Edition card. Um, this is just kind of a so show you how to set up the poor man's Ifinity, which is pretty easy and simple with that, with that video card. Um, I have three displays here. Um, all of them are different size. Uh, this is my 19 inch, my old 19 inch monitor. And then I got my 40 inch TV. And then I have my uh, 21 inch, uh, this is my 3D monitor. Um, all of them happen to be Samsung. Uh, that's just a coincidence, not brand loyalty or anything like that. But right now I have the them all plugged in to the tower over here. Um, the two actual computer monitors are, are uh, hooked in through the DVI and then I have my TV hooked in through the HDMI port on the video card bracket. Um, right now it's running the Windows extended display. This is not the this is not Ifinity running. This is just, you know, when you plug multiple monitors in, Windows automatically puts it as an extended display. Um, so how do you set up Ifinity is you open the Catalyst Control Center you go to desktop management, go to creating and arranging desktops, and then you'll see this is how my setup is. Uh, what you need to do is click one of the little black arrows here, and then you want to create a group. And then because mine is set up this way, what it does is it you know asks to disable the other monitors. I select yes. And then what it does is it turns off all the other monitors and then just leaves the middle one on. So now what it'll do is it'll pop up a layout. So now this is where I can set up how I want Ifinity to look. You can go one by two, two by one, three by one, one by three. So I'm gonna do the three by one, which goes straight across landscape style. I'll hit accept. And now because I've previously set this up, what happens is it, it's gonna automatically default it and it'll it already has it arranged correctly um, but if it's not arranged correctly what you need to do is just click the yes for this little right up here is the display arrangement correct do you, you hit no and then what it'll do is it'll pop up a little tutorial asking you you know click the blue screen so this one is blue right now that's gonna be my left screen middle ones blue now that's gonna be my middle screen and there you go now it's all popped up and it is arranged in the correct order. There's my desktop, and then this will be my middle one, and then this is my tail end one, and you can see that taskbar way down there in the corner. And then a, a nice neat little trick as well. Um, if you want to switch back and forth between the uh, Windows Extended Display and Ifinity, what I found is all you got to do is hit the Windows key and P. Hit Windows P it'll pop up your little uh, display here where you can switch between duplicate and extend if you go to extend what it does is it puts you back into the windows extended desktop mode and then if you hit P again go back to duplicate what it'll do is it'll flip you back into affinity mode so that's just a neat little shortcut as well um, if you like to flip back and forth between extended display and just turn on Ifinity for games. So this has been just a quick little Ifinity tutorial.